the logic in it all. I just... And all right, what's up, YouTube family? So today, me and my Rugrat are going to head to the mall today. Um, Big Thomas and Theo decided to stay home, to watch football, but that's cool because we're going to have fun, right? Yeah. We're going to see what this mall has to offer and, you know, might pick up one or two things. But, yay, let's get ready to go to the mall. It's only 20 minutes away and it snowed last night, so I'm hoping that the roads are clear. Like, from the looks of this parking lot, most of the snow has melted on the street at least. I'm hoping that the... Yeah, but not in our front yard. Yeah, not in our front yard and stuff. But I'm hoping the roads are clear. I, so I that's why I chose this mall. Because it's the closest one to the base. So cross your fingers that the roads have been salted. But let's go. I'm on such a mission. I didn't even realize I left my sunglasses on. Come on, Red Girls. Oh. <laughs> One in the five different shoe stores looking for these boots that Thomas wants. No one has them. Oh. And I don't even know what I'm in Burlington for. I forgot why I hate coming to the mall. I can't stand people. People don't know how to say excuse me or then they walk too slow all in front of you, I'm over it. <sighs> okay. <sighs> but we are leaving the mall. Um, the boots were a bust. Nobody has them. In the size we need or the colors. Like at this point I'll take any color. But one exciting thing is that I go to, but I went to the toy store and get it to see all the cool toys. Subscribe to my mom's channel, please. <laughs> Hold on, baby. Let me unlock the door. You should have brought gloves out. Since you're so cold. Oh. Okay, so we went to Finish Line, we went to Foot Locker, we went to this shoe outlet something that they got in there. We went to Two Journeys. Nobody has these boots. Ugh. So I'm guessing it's just not meant to be this Christmas. What do you want to say, Rugrat? If you, if you know where these boots are, can you tell us, please? <laughs> because it keeps... So the same way, we need to phone a friend because we can't find these boots. Like, not online, nowhere. I've tried Amazon, like, every possible place I could think of. Timberland's website, they don't even, they have the boots, but they don't go up to a size 12. They stop at an 11 and a half. It's just not meant to be. But we did get him a uh, chain. Because when we were at the temporary house, y'all remember that? He left his chain there. And then when he called to ask about it, like, you know, we figured once they would do the cleaning process, somebody would find it. But nobody found it. And they said they didn't see it. So... Can I see? So, 
went and got him another chain. And I'm type mad because I could have sworn any other place that I've been to, like, and I've bought a chain, especially how much you pay for these chains. Like, y'all know y'all go to the mall, and it's like those little, not the jewelry stores, but the little carts, like, in the middle. How it's always that one jewelry place right there. We went there, bought the chain. And it comes in a plastic bag, though. Like, a plastic bag. In Jersey, they give you the nice little gold box with the cotton inside of it. Like, all nice. Like, what What the hell? Is... So now I gotta go to the dollar store and see if they have a decorative box. Little jewelry box that I can put this in because this is ghetto. Like, this is real ghetto. So... Please don't lose it. So I got him a cross and um, a Jesus piece. He can switch it out as he likes. It's not exactly like the chain that he lost, but beggars can't be choosers at this point. <laughs> I had to go with what I could go with and he didn't have a thinner, smaller cross like Thomas originally had, so I had to get a different one <sighs> but I'm so ready to be done and I wanted some chick-fil-a so bad but today is Sunday what was I thinking got my hopes all up like mouth all set and ready for some chick-fil-a we go there and the gate is just down it's all dark <sighs> so now we're gonna try to find a McDonald's grab something to eat and then go to a dollar store, look for a decorative box, and we can go home. So, saying we yeah. have to do we are, so mom, you're just saying we have to do two more stuff, then it's home. Yes. Yes, it is. I want to say Well, no, more. not even two more things, because we need to go to the supermarket, to the commissary, to get milk and butter. I think we're good on bread. I'm not really sure. We're just, we gotta go to the commissary. We're all, we're all the bread that I use for my and get school. The, the basics. And, and Mike, can I have a one more thing? Go ahead, baby. Have you guys ever seen a big wolf? Because I'm gonna tame a, a big wolf. I don't know. You're gonna be doing that by yourself. Because I'm not trying to tame nobody's wolf. I'm going to tame it, but who's going to come with me? I don't know. You're going to have to figure that out for yourself. But it won't be me. Yeah. That's what I... Because I don't do nature like that. Wild animals and such. I am not trying to go tame. Nobody's wild animal. I'm not going to No, thank you. Mom. Okay. Well, you're going to be by yourself. I'm just letting you know that don't look for me for help. Because I can't help you. Why not? Because I, I don't do animals like that. I respect them enough to stay away. Mommy? Yes? Can I go to the, the huge wolf next Saturday? Ask your father. What? Ask your father if he'll go take you to tame the, the wild next Saturday. You go right on ahead and ask him. Y'all have fun with that. I won't be there. <sighs> I was upstairs, you know, just watching a movie, relaxing, being one with myself. And I kept smelling... It smelled like food was cooking, but I know I didn't have any food turned on and the boys had better not have touched the stove. So they shouldn't have had any food cooking. So I finally come downstairs because the smell just kept getting stronger and my wonderful husband put meatballs in the crock pot here. Let me show y'all. Husband put meatballs in the crock pot on high and then left to go watch the game at his friend's house. So at this point, the meatballs are sticking to the bottom. Half the sauce, like it's not even enough sauce. Half the sauce is gone. Like, I'm just, I'm confused. <sighs> the logic in it all, I just, and yes, I am still wearing my sunglasses because my regular glasses are in the car. And it's cold outside and I really don't feel like putting on shoes to go walk through the snow, to go to the car, to get my regular glasses. 
and these are prescriptions so I can still see through them it just I look crazy <sighs> but it still don't make no sense about these damn meatballs like oh lord and it doesn't even smell like he seasoned it it just smells like he just poured tomato sauce in there with the meatballs and then dipped like it would have been nice if he would have said something like sent a carrier pigeon or something as to what his intentions were for this like how do you cook a meal and then leave and then expect somebody else to finish it like i don't understand it oh lord but let me call him to ask him exactly what he was expecting to happen in this scenario that his intention was to make spaghetti but again like why wouldn't he have just said something so i'm just gonna finish this so that the boys can have something to eat and then get in the shower go to sleep because they have school tomorrow but still the communication <laughs> just i don't understand where it went Okay, so here is dinner for the boys. Here is Tom Tom's spaghetti. And I don't know, Theo's a little bit weird about his spaghetti. He doesn't like them mixed together, so you have to do it separately. So he just has buttered noodles here, meatballs and sauce over there. Um, yeah, I don't know why. He's, he's different. Okay, guys, so that basically wraps up day one of... 2020 12 days of Christmas over here. I couldn't do vlogmas this year. Like I barely have my life in order and to put up a vlog every day, I just, I wasn't going to be able to do it. So we're doing 12 days of Christmas this year, like we did last year. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed being raggedy with me and doing some last minute Christmas shopping because we all know it should have been done long long time ago and then on top of that i got an email from h&m where i ordered big thomas's christmas gifts from and they're no longer going to be here by christmas like everywhere else every other website every commercial i've seen they all say if you order by the 16th you will get your stuff by christmas but h&m is just as raggedy as i am and now they're like it's not gonna be here until after christmas sorry boo so, yeah, but at least we have the chain. So, oh, the sun, where are you? There you go. So at least Thomas will have something to open on Christmas. Um, I also did some online shopping last night 
and I ordered the boys some video games because Thomas is getting himself a new PlayStation. So he's going to give the boys his old PS4. So I got them some games to go on that. Um, I got them some child appropriate games because all the games that Thomas was recommending to me to get for them, like God of War and uh, what's the other one? Call of Duty, like all of that. No, they got to get some real child appropriate games. So they got some Crash Bandicoot, some um, Super Mario Brothers, like real Spyro, real child appropriate. So I ordered those. They are on the way. And I believe that's everything. Yeah, so my Christmas shopping is officially done. It is a wrap. It's over. I'm so over Christmas already. But okay, please make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. And I will see y'all in day two of our 12 days of Christmas. And I got to go to work right now. So, bye. Can I take you there?